This is the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra and I've been using it since it came out in 2021. It's been a great device that does everything I need, but now the Galaxy S24 Ultra has convinced me to upgrade for obvious reasons. Aside from the amazing camera that captures fantastic photos, the battery power and video capabilities are also incredible. I even published a short edit that I captured entirely on this device, so make sure you check it out. As someone who creates a lot of AI related content, this Samsung release has really caught my attention. I've been testing the S24 Ultra for almost a month now and in this video I'm going to share my favorite creative AI features that are built into every new device in the S24 series and I'll show you how to use them. In this tutorial, I'll be using my S Pen, but you can also use your fingers. Please note that some of these AI features require internet connection to work their magic, so make sure your device is connected. When you open a photo on your S24 device and tap the info icon, the AI analyzes the photo and gives you recommendations for automatic enhancement. For example, here I'm gonna tap remaster and see what happens. As you can see, the AI magically removed all the lens flares caused by dirty or smudged lens. The these edit suggestions work well in different scenarios, especially for adjusting the brightness and contrast of your photos. You can save the edits on top of your original photo or create a new copy, which is what I usually do. One of the most powerful AI features on this device is Generative Edit, and it's great for recentering subjects. To use it, simply tap the Edit tool and select the Galaxy AI star icon, then draw a rough outline around the subject to select it. Next, long press on the selection to move it. I'm gonna place it in the center of the frame. And to fill the empty space left behind, just hit generate. After a few seconds, Galaxy AI will generate new pixels that seamlessly blend with the original content. This feature is a real game changer and the best part is it saves you time by achieving computer level editing on your smartphone in just a few quick and easy steps. You can also use the generative edit to get rid of unwanted objects in your photos. In this example, there is a lantern which I think ruins the symmetry of the picture, so I wanted to remove it. And by the way, you can also automatically select objects by long pressing on them. To delete the selected object, just choose the eraser icon and tap generate to fill in the missing background. As you can see, the AI didn't only fill in the missing parts of the wall, but also added an old lamp similar to the one on the right side of the photo, which means it's really good at using context clues from the image to generate new elements. I've tested this in different situations and it works well even with complex scenarios such as crowd removal, and I would give it a rating of 9 out of 10. Another cool feature that has gone a little under the radar is the reflection removal tool. Let's say you took a picture from an airplane window and there are annoying reflections on the glass. To get rid of them, just tap the pencil icon at the bottom of the screen, then tap the four dots icon, choose object eraser, then tap erase reflections. The AI analyzes the image to remove reflections and magically fills in the gaps. It's not always perfect, especially in more complex situations, so there's room for improvement, but overall it's super useful and when it works, it's pretty amazing. Now I think it's safe to say that the instant slow motion feature is everyone's favorite among all the Galaxy AI tools. You can take a regular video and simply press and hold on it while playing to switch to slow motion. It's all thanks to the power of AI which generates new frames to slow down the footage while keeping it smooth. If you want more control, just tap the pencil icon, choose adjust speed and pick from different speed options to save the whole video or just part of it in slow motion. There is an incredibly powerful software called Topaz Video AI that I always use to turn videos into slow motion. I've compared it to what Galaxy AI can do and honestly you can't even tell the difference. Unfortunately, instant slow-mo doesn't work with HDR videos but you can easily disable that in your camera app settings by going to advanced video options and toggling off HDR 10 plus. The Galaxy AI Pack has another really cool feature called the Wallpaper Generator tool. To try it out, go to your device settings, open Wallpaper and Styles, and tap Change Wallpapers. Scroll down to the Creative section and tap on Generative. From there, you can choose one of the options from the Create Something New section. You can select 
prompts related to subjects, colors, and styles. And once you tap generate, you will get a selection of completely new AI generated wallpapers. Choose one you like by tapping set. Decide if you want the wallpaper to appear on lock screen, home screen, or both and tap next. If you're happy with the preview, tap done. And just like that, you have a new unique wallpaper. I think this feature adds some personality to the suite of Galaxy AI tools, which mostly focus on productivity and convenience. And speaking of convenience, Circle to Search is a Google-powered feature that lets you quickly look up information without having to switch apps. Just tap and hold the home button, circle or tap the object you're curious about, and a quick web search will start. It's super handy for learning more about landmarks, finding recipes, or even shopping for products that you come across. And if you ever need to transcribe a conversation or a video, just record your voice and use transcript assist galaxy ai will transcribe the audio for you and you can even request quick summaries or have the entire transcript translated other communication focused features include a live translator that lets you translate phone calls in real time on your device and provides both audio and on-screen text translations. There's also a real-time interpreter that can translate offline conversations between people speaking different languages. There's even a chat assist tool that can help you refine tones in messages and many more features that are so powerful yet easy to use. With these tools coming to smartphones, we're entering a time where AI is making a much bigger impact on our daily lives. The Galaxy S24 series is a great example example of that. What excites me even more is that these breakthroughs pave the way for more advanced AI tools which will bring new possibilities to mobile content creation. As smartphone chipsets continue to advance, we can expect to see even more powerful AIs like Stable Diffusion running smoothly on our phones sooner than we think. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, so let's keep the conversation going in the comments below. Stay creative, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.